Hi guys, this is Rusty with another installment of Ugly HP. Today we're going to be talking about the notorious vacuum leaks on the 5.4s and 4.6s. Obviously you see this thing is not running good at all. Has a very stumble, stalls out whenever they come to a stop. Sometimes it's even hard to start. Uh, a lot of times you scan them out. And let me see if I can get this where you can see it. And you get codes like this, system too lean lack of O2 switch in um, it's gonna be hard for me to show you this in the total shoot so I'm gonna cut out here I'm gonna pull out the piece and see if I can get you a view of where it's at on the 5 fours. the 5 fours are a little bit deeper than the 4 sixes but uh, we'll get the piece out that shows you that does this every single time and it's just because of the heat that you know messes the rubber up causes it to dry rot and crack and suck in but stay tuned Okay, so these are the pieces, or this is the piece, it's now pieces, but it all it is a bigger hose that dumps it down to a small one. Now, if you go to your local parts store, you can pick one up, looks like that. Some of them are shaped a little bit different. They're not in the help section, they're over by the oil filters and the vacuum section. And this is a hard one to see, I don't think you're actually going to be able to see the tube, but this is a 5.4 we're working on, right there is your idle air control motor in the back where that glare is underneath that is where the tube that goes to a hose that goes around to the passenger side and the hose is just a plastic hose right there and that is the most common failures on four sixes and five fours this will happen to you if you have a four six and a five four it's just the heat does that to that rubber but that's your fix very quick and easy part only cost me $12 as always like subscribe and keep on wrenching